Hey, good time friends. It's good time Adam coming at you with the Topps Chrome Blaster 2022. This is the home of the Chrome Rookie Autograph. Looking for Wander. Really want to find an O'Neill Cruz. Would love an O'Neill Cruz Auto. Uh, Spencer Strider would be cool. I have a nice short print of him from Series 2. So let's get into this and see what we find. I know, uh, you know, the bad news about not having the short prints in these kind of sucks so we'll see uh i've also seen a lot of people have terrible quality control issues with these so i'm really hoping we got a good clean box here uh with no qc issues just some amazing cards maybe an auto let's see what we get this is my first pack of this stuff we got a Lars Newbar was talking about him. They were playing the Buccos last night. I was at the club talking about him. Jesse Winker, Kranick, Brian De La Cruz, and a Ronald Acuna Sepia. Those are not numbered. You know, I have an Acuna last year of that. Uh, the Sepia. So that's pretty cool. Would love an O'Neill Cruz of that. Obviously, Gavin Sheets. Nice rookie, JT Romuto, Jacob DeGrom in the 87 design. Those are sweet. I love Topps 87. First cards I ever collected. They're awesome. Then we got an Alec Manoa. These are sharp. I'm not seeing any QC issues. Um, I had one five-card pack and one four-card pack. There's Tim Anderson. We saw see a refractor back there. Matt Olson, what do we got? An Adam Frazier in that, not numbered. That's just the, I don't know what that's called. Justin Turner and an Adam Wainwright, pink, also not numbered. But I am not seeing the QC issues that some people are having. So I'm pretty excited about that. Seems to be a nice clean box. Alec Verdu Verdugo. There's Garrett Cole, ex Bucca, Mookie Betts. Now that's a little, you know, off to the right a bit, but still, I've seen way worse out of these. Josh Lowe. I mean, I've seen some that are just awful. That's a 60 40. I can handle that. You know, I'm not going to get mad about that. Um, but with some of these other ones, I would be mad about. Ozzy Albies. Max Kepler, we got a heart of the city, Aaron Judge. That's a beautiful card right there. He's a beast. Jonathan India, Gold Cup. And a Luke Williams sepia rookie card. Would have loved for that to be an O'Neill Cruz. We got three packs left. Really want to get at least a base Cruz. I'm a Bucko fan, as you know, if you ever watched the video. I'm a Pittsburgh guy. So, I love all things Pittsburgh. Lazardo, Jose Abreu, and speaking of Pittsburgh, there's Brian Reynolds. He's their best player, probably, besides O'Neill Cruz. Well, O'Neill Cruz has the upside. Uh, Brian Reynolds is probably the best one currently. Um, but how about Pools last night hitting 701? Reed Detmers. It's pretty nice. Was watching that at the club. Andre Jackson, because it was against the Buccos. Charlie Blackman and Tyler Glass now, an ex bucko there that we gave away. That's what pirates do. This is our last chance for an O'Neill Cruz and for an auto. Let's see. Adolis Garcia, Austin Riley, Kiner Falefa, and Brandon Crawford. So. We didn't hit any of the big, big rookies. I guess the biggest rookie we hit was probably Lars, Gavin Sheets. I would say my favorite card is probably this one, though. The Judge, Heart of the City. Let me know what you guys think. Are you guys hitting anything great? For me, this wasn't great. I'm not going to lie. Don't know how many more of these I'm going to get. But if it's what I can find, it's what I can find. So, let me know what you guys think. Have you pulled anything good? Are you seeing a lot of cool stuff? Um, and, you know, try and stay dry. I hope everyone down in Florida is doing all right, along the coast doing all right. And, uh, you know, if you can, have a good time and have a great weekend. <laughs>